D5 Lite, a real-time AI-powered plugin for SketchUp. Here, it can generate AI images for quick ideation, or you could use that as a lightweight visualization tool. It supports lights and assets. So check this out. If I hit Asset Library and I click any of these guys, I'm gonna get these blobs, and these blobs are proxies. They represent trees, right? So this is great because you don't need to leave your software. You're doing everything in your source application. Same thing with lights. D5 renders on my left. All the edits we did, so the boardwalk, the lights, the assets are all here and it's grouped nicely. Pretty handy if you just wanna work conceptually. The ocean tool, so what you see here is an infinitely long ocean tool where basically you can customize every single parameter about the ocean. I can tell it to recalculate the coastline and boom. To access it, all you have to do is hit terrain and ocean and then you're gonna get a controller like you would with terrain. This is real time, true displacement. What happens here is once you toggle on true displacement and it's a setting that you need to toggle on over here, hit more settings. This is going to let you subdivide the faces. So watch this. If I switch over to a wireframe, look at the density of my cube here. As I increase this, it's going to give more and more resolution to the shape. Look at that. And it's going to make it look more realistic because it's actually adding geometry to the height map. Any individual user, no longer a Teams account, gets access to XR Tours and Cesium. Cesium is basically that 3D plugin that brings in Google Maps 3D data. So look at this, it is literally streaming in data. Again, this is no longer tied to D5 Teams. They've updated the AI agent. If I click AI scene match, I can give it an actual prompt to update my scene. I can replace this and say early evening light setup, and I'll send that off and apply those settings to your scene. And then once it's done thinking, it'll generate an image. So this is basically the target. And if it sounds great, you can just click apply the atmosphere. And what's even crazier is you can also click recommend assets similar to those in the reference image, and it'll look at the D5 library and suggest assets. And there we go. Look at that. I mean, that is pretty close. Is if I write too much, there was no way of seeing the full name. Well, now look at that. We've got resizable sidebar. 